Experts have identified ICT as a major source of generating revenue and creating jobs in Nigeria to serve as an alternative in the face of dwindling oil prices. However, for Nigeria to fully benefit the potentials that lie in the ICT sector, it must ensure that Nigerians living in the rural and urban areas are connected to either broadband or mobile internet. In this next report, our online correspondent Victor Matthias takes a look at how close Nigeria is to fulfilling its potential in the ICT sector. Information and communication technology ICT has become a crucial factor in the survival of individuals, businesses and governments globally. <laughs> However, with millions of Nigerians living in poverty, coupled with the high cost of data, Nigeria is yet to tap the full benefits ICT can provide. ICT it is a major tool to any economic development in any part of the world. In fact, we should build it strongly. As the House of Representatives consider the proposed communication service tax, which would require consumers of communication services to pay a 9% tax for the use of these services, experts say this move may hamper ICT development in the country. That's a wrong move. Um, for years, when Amazon started, it was actually an act of Congress that people didn't pay sales tax if you bought online. Um, you see how much Amazon is contributing to the economy of the U.S. today. So we cannot be short-sighted. We cannot tax the inputs because that limits how much there is to invest. We have to focus on outputs, taxations, and the government has to understand that. The question that comes to mind is what is the government doing to move the country towards ICT growth? With a significant percentage of Nigeria's population having access to mobile cellular services, the increasing and sustained growth in internet usage and broadband deployment, the government through the Ministry of Communications and its various smart initiatives are focused on leveraging ICT to create an inclusive economy. This year's World Economic Forum in Davos, Switzerland had as its theme the fourth industrial revolution, indicating that it is time for a paradigm shift. Already in advanced countries, people have begun to walk the talk. My dad has actually used the internet to uh, repair tractors and to buy equipment that he needs um, because he, uh, he can go online so we don't have to worry about traveling two to three hours to get a piece of equipment. Um, I've also uh, am able to look up uh, like laws, regulations that might affect me as a grower. The same may not be said of Nigerian rural farmers, but with over 90 million Nigerians connected to mobile internet, experts believe it is the right path to follow. If Nigeria is to join the fourth industrial revolution and achieve its goal of being one of the top 20 economies by the year 2030, it must embrace ICT in all sectors to stimulate the economy and improve ICT penetration in both mobile telephony and broadband services to all parts of the country, no matter how remote. Victor Matthias, Channel Television News.